You know, it feels like it's been 3,000 years since I last played this game. And it hasn't been 3,000 years. It's been one month. <laughs> so the thing is, in all my infinite wisdom, I had accidentally deleted the files I needed for episode 9, thinking they were the files for episode 8, because I just happened to have them on the still re I didn't delete them like I was supposed to. And then I thought they were the wrong, they were the episode 9 files, so I deleted the episode 9 files, so now here we are, we're at the do episode 9 now. So welcome back to Team Sonic Racing. I had already opened five mod po four mod pods, because I had already completed the Team Grand Prix and the race that's after it, which is a survival race. And then, because it didn't take that long to those two events, I did this Daredevil event. Which was, as you would expect, a rage change of me being very pissed off because it's a shitty event. And then I did this Eggpond Assault because Eggpond Assault is actually a good event. I will not be redoing this. I would sooner rather die. There are a number of things I'd rather do than this. Because fuck dead over events. So basically the plan is, we're gonna do this, we're gonna do this, and we're gonna do the Eggpond Assault. I already have Chapter 5 unlocked, as you can see. We have it. We're not gonna do it yet. But, we're going to do this Team Grand Prix. I know I have to use Team Dark. When cheating fails, cheat harder. I know I have to use Team Dark. So, we're going to use Team Dark. I don't even remember what the mod pods were I unlocked. I don't even know who I used before. Let's just use Shadow. I'm eager to win this. So, let's go. Why am I not doing better? Is it me? No, of course not. There must be something wrong with this car I'm driving. Typical. The creator always blames his creations. I believe I told you to zip it, Orbot! Fortunately, I know how to create an even better racing car. Behold, the Formula M! With this vehicle, I can't lose! I should probably get around to creating better robot henchmen, too. What do you think, Orbot? Can't respond. Zipping it. boy. So, considering I haven't played this game in a month, this is probably going to be very painful. So I know for this event we're supposed to collect a bunch of rings, I think what happened the first time was, I was complaining a lot about getting hit by everything, so I wasn't getting rings. Wow, why does that feel familiar? It's not like I didn't do that before. <laughs> Yeah, you're- yeah, you keep telling yourself that, Eggman. You'll notice there's a new f fuck's sake! Oh my god, we're off to a great start. You'll notice there's a new fixture here, all of a sudden, out of complete nowhere, and it's Metal Sonic. Metal Sonic was on any events prior to now. He is now suddenly here. Yes! I- what the hell? Did they die? How the hell did they end up over here? But yeah. Metal Sonic is here, it will not be addressed at all, until like, after these events, after this race is over, but, yeah, Metal Sonic is here now, suddenly, so get used to him, because we're probably going to be seeing more of him. Also, I am somehow in first place. Our team, however, is in like, bottom spots. Oh my god, nice cube. But yeah, so... I don't remember anything I said or did in the original recording because, you know, it's been a month since then. Okay, what is that? Oh my goodness! But watch, I'm probably gonna end up playing better this time than I did before because that's just the natural course of things. Um, yeah, you do that, Rouge. Oh my gosh, Jesus! Why does this feel like a polar opposite of what happened in the original? I feel like I'm playing so well. Invincibility. Oh my god. Never mind. I got my set earlier. Oh, hi, Rouge. You're gonna use that boost? Because I would love to take it off your hands. <laughs> Alright, let's go this way. Seems like this way is just objectively faster. I mean, fortunately, there's nothing... Alright, yeah, Omega, uh... WHAT THE- I didn't even know these hit you, what the hell? Rouge, please. 
Fortunately, after this, we are going to start using just whoever. So, I think this will be the end. Okay, well then again, I start to... What is that? Oh, crap. Take it. But yeah, after this this chapter, I am going to be alternating between the teams. I'm gonna use this in... Right now. I press the button. Oh my god. Why does it feel like my drifting is even more out of control now? Oh, well, that's fine. Here. Wasn't it Omega that gave me those earlier? I think it was. But, oh well, I don't need them. But yeah, after this chapter, I will be alternating between the teams. So we'll do some races with Team Sonic, some races with the other teams. Just like, oh, come on! Ray Quake Festival! <laughs> I see some things never change. Oh, and Rouge just, like, sucked all those items up, so I didn't get anything. Nice, thanks, Rouge. Yep, I, I see nothing has changed from when I stopped playing this game. And one of those things is, yeah, my allies and everyone else taking my items like it's Christmas. We don't even- we didn't even get build up ultimate. Nice. It's fine. Fine, we're probably getting top three. We're getting top three. Perfect. Off to a great start. I see nothing has changed from the last time I played this game. I mean, except for the fact I'm closer to Steam achievements, but you know, who cares about that? I don't even think those appear on the screen. Like, in the recording, I mean. Because I can see them. Because, you know, Steam version. But, I don't think they're on the screen. So. That's basically all I have to think about, dude. Just, okay, what would I, when did I say when I did this before? It's all, like, the thing is. When I play racing games, it's a world of difference from when I play RPGs. When I play RPGs, it's usually natural, especially when you're playing RPG Maker games, they have to fill the void of time with me talking about random nothing while I, f I brainlessly fight enemies. You, especially during the sections where I have to kill random encounters to get through. Oh my god, I didn't even get a box. But yeah, during the sections where I have to kill random encounters to get through. I'm not saying that always happens, but happens often enough. Gee, Omega, oh I didn't know that. Got boost. Ah! <laughs> Watch a great start. Unfortunately, it's only lap one. I mean, I can always... Oh my god. Fuck off, you stupid robot. Oh my gosh. Bruh. I didn't get anything out of that. Are you serious? Can you do that, Omega? Oh god! Ah, the camera! <laughs> Alright. I missed everybody! Are you for real? Oh my gosh. Dude, Jesus, what is this? This is the race where I can't get any fucking items. Oh, that's a laser. That's a laser. Yep. Yep. Well, excuse me, Rouge. I got hit by a fucking laser. Oh god, that's a rock. Alright, nice. Big boost. You do that, Shadow. Again? I didn't get a fucking box there. Same exact set. Meanwhile, everyone's just... Oh. Thanks, Wawaga. Oh god! That was Eggman. Someone was directly behind me. Alright, good. Fuck you, Metal Sonic. Oh my gosh, how did I not hit that? Really? Alright, go. 
Who's in front? Why go all my rings? That's silver. Alright, nice. Someone's in an ultimate. Someone is directly behind me in an ultimate. It is Blaze. You're in seventh place, Rouge. That's not bad. I'll take it. I feel like the way we're gonna win this now is if I build up. Wow, I should have. Yeah. Well, I mean, this is gonna give me rings. Wait, what the hell? Did the void just protect me from that laser? Wow. Never mind. I'm getting I'm getting slapped by it, but nothing's happening. I'm gonna see that was Omega's laser. Because that thing literally came into direct contact with me more than once, and nothing happened to me. What is it? What the hell? Why was that one box just hanging up in the fucking sky? Alright. Silver, fuck you. Silver literally died. Alright. This is fine. It's not fine anymore. Ah, you f Well, there go all my rings again! It's a good thing I already got the key. Oh my god, fuck this, go. Rouge, please, enough windows. It's either that, or I'm the one making them sound like that by thinking of it that way, but, you know, it wouldn't be the first time I took something out of context. Also, still got top three. Even with me choking twice, we still got top three. Maybe I should start playing against hard bots, but I feel like if I start playing against hard bots, I'm gonna get absolutely throttled. But you never know. That eggplant sucks. Dead last. Wish you could. You knew what individual scores were between races, but all right. Nope. This game is all about the team mechanics, and I remember something now from the last version of this video. I complained a lot during the Daredevil event because I was bashing my head against the wall during that. Because of course I was. Yeah, I remember exactly what I was what I said during that now. I was going on and on and on about how this game is so heavily dependent on the team mechanics that anything that doesn't have to do with the team mechanics feel like they were done half-assed at the last minute. In comparison, like, any solo content in this game feels like it's half-assed. And it's very notable in the rain challenges and daredevil events, because their difficulty level is so much higher out of complete nowhere in comparison to everything else. The rest of the content is really damn easy. But if you want all the keys, you have to do... Who the stupid ass daredevil events and ring challenges. Which are very, very particular. If you want to do them well. The daredevil events basically mandate drifting. If you don't drift, you will lose. You have no chance if you're not drifting on the daredevil events. Whereas the ring challenges, you only get time, no matter what, you only get time from drifting. Oh my god. Oh my god, Blaze, you f I'm assuming that was Blaze. I don't know who it was, I'm just gonna assume it was Blaze. Okay. Wow. I was in that for a while and I barely got any, any speed out of it. Okay, good. They choked. It was Blaze. I was right. Take my item. I don't need it. Ah! Alright, let's go. Omega. God. Alright, perfect. We are gonna fly. I'm gonna miss the items again. Holy shit, I'm moving very fast. But yeah. I went on about that for a while. Oh crap, I saw it. I saw it. It's Great Quake Festival. Tails, please! There are children watching. <laughs> Plus, 
lost your kid. There's a massive age difference between you two. <laughs> but yeah, I that was like the there were people in ultimates coming up behind me. Well, it's a good thing I already got the key. I'm pretty sure what happened was I must have gotten a lot of rings on like race four or something. Cause yeah, what's happening here with the great quakes is basically what happened in the first time. Great quakes everywhere, me getting hit in really hilariously stupid ways. Why did I do that? Actually, never mind, that's a good idea. People are behind me. Just use some of them. Fucking hell, Blaze! How the hell are you speeding ahead of me like that? Where are you going to get ahead like that? But yeah, so. I'm not a fan of how this game kind of acts like it's single player content. It's solo content is lesser. Blaze? Blaze? Dude, she's pushing me! Fucking hell, Blaze. Rouge, please. Stop. <laughs> please, just act, please stop. Take it. This is worthless. I'll use it. Blaze is behind me. Why does it feel like that did absolutely nothing? Because it probably did. Holy crap, holy shit. Jesus, the speed. The sonic speed is too much for me. I'm just a. I usually go slow because I play I play Fire Emblem at the speed of a fucking turtle. <laughs> because chapter 20 of Path of Radiance is almost two hours, which is why I say that I play Fire Emblem at the speed of a fucking turtle. Okay, good. We also have nice rings. So hopefully we can finish the race with nice rings. The annoying- Okay, no, Rouge is behind me. Okay, it's fine. I was say, watch, boys is just gonna fucking show up out of nowhere and pass me at the last second again. And then be on my ass for the rest of the damn race. Okay, no, I wanna finish this race with nice- Never mind. Well, there, go there it goes, it's gone. Get your 69 jokes in while you can, because it's gone now. Unfortunately. Alright, well, looks like Blaze is not going- Never mind, she's catching up. She's catching up very quickly. She's already in third. And we're not getting any closer. Um, yeah, you do that- Oh, no! I hate, once again, I'm gonna say it, how you lose all your rings if you get hit by something in this game. It's a good thing rings aren't a currency in this game. Because if you lose all your rings to getting hit by- how the fuck did you get third, Rouge? You were right behind me! Well, I guess it was Blaze. Fucking hell, Blaze. Dude, she was right behind me. How the hell? I mean, it's, it's fine. We basically auto-win this event. They may as well just give me the win right now. Type specific list. The laser is exclusive to power types? Are you for real? So if I want the steam achievement that requires you to use laser, I can only get it as a power type character. This is what I mean! Why the hell are there, there type specific lists? That's like playing Mario Kart and having items exclu- Okay, well then again, Double Dash already did that. Certain groups of characters had exclusive items to them. Nice. But yeah, Mario Kart Double Dash did that, but the way Double Dash did it was actually a lot better. Certain characters had certain items that fit them well. I mean, yeah, sure, the golden being locked behind Toad and Toadette was really dumb, but fortunately that was a one game only thing. But here, the power type has three exclusive wisps. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my gosh, go to fucking hell. Oh my gosh. Please, Omega. How do I already have an ultimate built up? Um, I'll use this. 
I mean, it's not gonna help me because I already have another item stored away. Up. Oh. Up. Oh, we got Tails boost. Here. I don't need it. Someone did an ultimate though. Oh. Fucking Eggman. Oh, it's a laser. Hold on. Hold on. We can do some fun stuff with this. It's called the race egg, man. All right, go. Someone else has a laser behind me. Oh, I got it. I got the scene achievement. Nice. All right, good. Let's go. I hit the egg pond. Fuck you, Mile Sonic. Fuck you, Eggman! Oh god, Blaze has it too. Alright, so here's the play. Well, I'm gonna oh god, it, here it comes! Great Quake Festival! Wait, where is it? Oh, there it is! Ah! Yep, fuck. Or do I have that? Never mind! Never mind again, I have more. All right, here you go. I don't need that. Could have taken it earlier, so I could have gotten a box. Thanks. But meanwhile, we still have to worry about Blaze primarily. She's like the only actual threat right now. I mean, yeah, sure, we're in second place overall, but hit one. I have like a hang of them. Hard to tell. You don't really get much confirmation many times when you hit someone in this game. Uh, this side. Or just put it in the middle of the road. Someone's bound to hit it. No one hit it. Are you for real? Well, I mean, in the perfect world, we can get an ultimate and then just blaze away. But, oh crap, they're right behind me. Please. Fuck you, boys. Go. They're an ultimate, too. Everything is happening all at once. Oh, my God. Okay. Okay. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. We're top three. It's fine. I have plenty of defensive items now. Well, more like offensive items, because defense doesn't really mean much of anything in this game, unless you're a power type. Because the only one who gets the void is the power types, you know. That's nice at all. Something's coming. Oh my god. It's that damn last turn that always gets me. Alright, we got top three. I always hope so. God. Top three. Perfect. Wait! What? I already have the key game! Don't tell me I'm making progress toward that Steam achievement. But yeah, clean sweep. With Metal Sonic in the mix, this race could get even more dangerous. I don't like that mean robot. He's just a fancy tin can. Nothing to worry about, big. Actually, he's slightly more dangerous than a tin can. Well, he races like a tin can. Let's get back on the track. Yo. Once again, Team Metal Sonic was literally added to the race with absolutely zero fanfare. It's almost as if he just kind of poofs in out of nowhere. There was no explicit mention of Eggman adding Metal Sonic to the race, or even Dodonpa adding Metal Sonic to the race. He just appears. This game is not very well written, I swear. <laughs> so before we do the survival race, we're going to do this Egg Pond Assault. I'm not doing the Dare for Devil event. You cannot pay me enough to redo this shit. So we're going to do this. And we're going to use Omega just because we're going to blob stuff. And now I know that frickin' power types have more stuff about them than everyone else, because that's fair. Game, I, I swear, if I had never seen that hint, I think I would have a better opinion of this game. Slightly. Not by much, but... <laughs> Not by much. 
again. Oh, great. We have to play Haunted Castle twice because we have to do a survival race on Haunted Castle, too. All right. So we know how, how these kinds of events work. We blow up stuff and we get points out of it like this. Okay, not like, not like that, where I missed. We can also just ram into them. Which fortunately makes my life easier. But yeah, the goal is just blow them up, get time. Shut up. Oh my god. Oh, I don't have any more. Okay. Okay. Oh god, I'm running out of time. Oh my gosh, I'm actually doing worse. Okay, I hit something. Oh, I have it. We're already done. Okay, we, we still did it, it's fine. We're getting silver. Um, I broke the music. There it is. <laughs> what the hell was that? The music broke. Well, we did it. We got one, we got silver at least, and I already got the key off screen, so. So, I'm always time, let's go. So, we need to spin out fewer than 10 times, which is probably not gonna happen. Fall off the track fewer than 10 times, which is probably not gonna happen. And finish the survival race without losing a team member, which probably won't happen either, but, you know. Right. Yeah, you can say that again, Silver. So we're gonna use Rouge, just to get the damn e windows out of the way, for good. Temporarily, at least. Um, what do I have for bonus boxes? Uh... I can start with a laser. Uh, let's do... Let's do this. Thinking about how badly I'm gonna beat you in the next race? What? Oh, no. I'm thinking about something else. Come on, man. Get your head in the game. I'm totally gonna make you look silly out there. You wanna win, right? Right, yeah. Okay. Winning. You ever have one of those feelings? Like... Like... Like you're about to get your car fed to you by a blue hedgehog? No, never. I'm not hungry, but thanks. Wow, dude. You take all the fun out of trash talking. Alright, so I know that when I did this before, I didn't actually get the key. Because someone got eliminated on lap 2. So hopefully, we don't have that happen again. But we have to play this shitty track again, so yeah. Probably unlikely. Okay. No, you're supposed to say, in your dreams, Sonic. In your dreams, Sonic. Too late. The moment's passed. Acceptable. Alright, here we go. I remember not liking this track very much, but, well, here we go. Successful. Well, congratulations, Sh Shadow, you're in last place! What the hell are you talking about? No, I... I do feel like, though, that there's... A lack of event types in this guy almost fell off the damn ledge. Like, there's a lack of event types in this game. Cause like Yeah. In Transformed, we had things like the boost we had like the boost challenge and other sort of challenges. I have, we have not seen anything like the boost challenge, to where there are no items and you just have to race. There's not even events where you have to- even solo races. This reminds me so much of Need for Speed Underground 2, which is another game I did not like very much, because every race, except for the final one, relies so heavily on four-player races. Well, I mean, the thing with that game is more... Well... A lot of problems. 
I mean, I have a universal hatred for drag races and Need for Speed in general, but Underground 2 is just not very good. And then add in the fact that a lot of the... That I think all the Street X events are just copy-pasted the tracks from Underground 1. Please... Oh, they both have items. Well, um, yeah, we're definitely not getting the key. Because I didn't get an ultimate. I think they're both about to get eliminated. Yeah, Shadow's about to get eliminated. One of them is, at least, so we're not getting the key. Meanwhile, here I am, just front-running. Yep, there goes Omega. Well, at least we can still use our ultimate. I mean, if Shadow gets eliminated, then we're gonna have to carry this event. Alright, let's use our ultimate now. But yeah, this seems like a casual fucking stroll. No one else is- Ah, never mind, there it is. Oh my god, where is my speed? I just went to a fucking crawl! Well, actually, yo, speaking of which, look at the mini-map. Everyone else is like 3,000 miles behind me. I was- I was just driving normally. How the hell did everyone else fail so hard? The AI just had a fucking episode where everyone and their mother failed in every conceivable way. Well, that was that was a hilarious failure on my part. I where how did I? I've never been that way before. No shadow is basically fucked at this rate because there are no more items, so it's up to him. He's got to get up there on his own merits. Otherwise, I'm just gonna finish this race three million miles ahead of the pack. Yeah, he's not gonna get that. Moon Great Quake Festival! <laughs> I walked away for three seconds! I got fucking Great Quake Festival! Um, nope. Shadow's fucked. Never mind. You might have a chance. Just barely. Just barely, Shadow. Alright, please. I mean, it really doesn't matter what place he gets. As long as I finish in first, we still win. At least I think so. I think it's one of those events. I mean, it should be fine. I mean, still in four. Four is not a bad spot. It's just that I'm so far ahead that... You know, Rouge is supposed to be slower, right? She's a technique type. Thought technique types were supposed to be slow. And yet, meanwhile, here I am, literally, like, ways accelerating. Oh, never mind. Here they come. Oh, it's probably because they have two members left, so I can still use ultimate. Up! Oh, I fucking bonked! Oh my god, it's so over. Wait, it might not be over. There might be a chance. There's a cube. Oh, never mind. It's fine. It's fine. Look at that. They're miles behind still. That's another cube. I think that was the one I put down earlier. Thanks, Shadow. Um, why did you give me this? You need items better more than I. Oh, never mind. Wob. And just like that, that's what we call the Rouge Sweep. Wow. Pathetic. That's what we call the Rouge Sweep. Amy and Chow got the... <laughs> wow. We still won, but just barely. All because I was front-running the whole race. Nice. All right.
job out there, Silver. I said, good job out there. What? Oh, thanks. Jeez, Silver, it's almost like you've never heard a compliment in your life. Well, I mean, I know you don't come from a post-apocalyptic future in this game, but still. So, we're doing that. We unlock Chapter 5, which has another team race on a mirror track we've already played before. So that's going to be great. But, speaking of tracks that we already played before, instead of doing this, next time we're going to be doing the second Grand Prix. So that should be great. But before we do that, as always, as is tradition here on Team Sonic Racing, we're going to open some Mod Pods. So we're in three events, so we're opening three Mod Pods. So today, our Mod Pods are... A Crimson Eagle. A Super Grip. And Rapid Wheels for Shadow. It's a real shame that we're not using Team Dark, I think. I think the team I'm using for the Grand Prix is Team Chaotix, so we're not using Team Dark yet. So next time, we're going to be using Team Chaotix for the Grand Prix, and I'm probably not going to be picking the Technique type character this time. I'm probably just going to go all in on speed. So look forward to that, and hopefully this time, I don't accidentally delete the wrong files! So I'll see you then. For reals this time. I mean it.